Margaret Knight, the female Edison. Margaret Knight was born in York, Maine in 1838. She grew up in poverty, the daughter of a widow struggling to support her children after her husband died. Margaret's childhood was marked by necessity. Her family had very little money. She had to work. She had to contribute to the family's survival. At age 12, Margaret was working in a textile mill in New Hampshire. The mills were dangerous places. Industrial machinery moved at terrifying speeds. Accidents were common. Children lost fingers, hands, arms. One day, Margaret witnessed a horrific accident. Another child was struck by a loom shuttle, a rapidly moving part of the machinery. The child was injured terribly. Margaret, only 12 years old, observed this tragedy and she immediately began thinking about solutions. She designed a safety device, a mechanism that would stop the loom shuttle if something or someone came into contact with it. The device would prevent the shuttle from moving, thus preventing injuries like the one she had just witnessed.